On October 4, 2023, Pope Francis transcended ecclesiastical boundaries with his apostolic exhortation Laudate Devum, infusing the sacred into the urgent discourse on climate change. In a groundbreaking fusion of faith and environmental stewardship, the pontiff extends a clarion call to protect our common home, Earth. As Pope Francis intricately weaves spiritual and ecological threats, Laudate Deum emerges as a guidepost challenging believers and global citizens alike to harmonize their reverence for God with a profound commitment to safeguarding the planet. Join us, the Trinitarians in India, during this Advent season as we unpack the profound messages woven into this magnum opus for a meaningful preparation and celebration of Christmas. Dear friends, today we are going to discuss about the 15th paragraph in Laudate Dei. Here Pope Francis invites us to examine the relation between human being and other beings. He says, the way we treat the earth and its other creatures is changing. Once we live alongside them as companions, sharing the same planet and its resources. But now our actions have turned them into victims. We have taken too much from the earth and we have given too little in return. We have polluted the air and water, and we have destroyed their homes. We have hunted them to the brink of extinction, and we have forced them to change their ways of life. As a result, the oceans are getting warmer and more acidic, and the oxygen levels and all these harm many species, and some of them may never recover. We have to remember that this is just one of many signs that we have lost our balance with nature. We are no longer living in harmony with the earth and its other creatures. We are abusing them and we need to pay their price. Pope Francis invites us to change our ways by learning how to live in harmony with nature again. So, the apostolic exhortation of Pope Francis reminds us that this is the time to change. We need to act now in order to save our planet and its other creatures. And the future of our planet is dependent upon each one of us. So, as we closely prepare for the Christmas, one of the concrete actions in order to save our planet is that avoid cutting any trees. And if it is necessary to cut, plant double the trees we cut. Thank you.